Thanks very much. As you know, and Rangers fans know, the focus of the offseason was to rebuild the pitching rotation. Thanks to Chris Young's hard work and the ownership group, they did that and, in fact, have arguably one of the best rotations in all of baseball. Now, when you come to as many baseball games as I do, you eat a lot of food. And as they introduced the new food for 2023, I thought, this is my rotation. Let us figure out the ace of this rotation, and let's also determine the closer. Ladies and gentlemen, your attention please. On the mound for the Rangers, the Boomstick Burger. What I'm really excited to show you is our addition to the Boomstick, the Boomstick Burger. It's a two foot long hamburger. Definitely a little nostalgia there and to add the burger to it and all the, the onion rings and the jalapenos, you got the whole, the whole family can eat off that thing. So it's pretty cool to see that. Now pitching for the Rangers, corn ribs. I was pleasantly surprised by the corn ribs. It's good and I think it's the kind of thing that like you can have your kids and say, okay, they can eat that and feel good about it. Your attention, please. On the mound for the Rangers, the PLT. We try to take care of every one of the Texas Ranger fans, whether that's gluten-free, whether that's vegan, or whether you're going all in on a two-foot burger. I couldn't do it, John. I just I just couldn't do it. I'm not, I'm not going there. I got to have meat. On the mound for the Rangers, the Pizza Dog. So the Pizza Dog and I became friends. And, and for me, I'm always thinking, like, what would my 11-year-old want? Yep. She'll want the pizza dog. Give me something that's got a hot dog in it because we're at the ball game, okay? It's like ballpark food should be. It's portable and, and easy to handle. So I could go with that as, as my starter for the World Series. Ladies and gentlemen, we have an ace of the staff. Ladies and gentlemen, on the mound for the Rangers, making his major league debut. He can throw some smoke. The flaming hot Cheetos pretzel. Do you have to be a special Texan to enjoy the flaming hot Cheetos pretzel? I think you have to be a teenager. <laughs> you know, I, I think I think that's the key. I'm a teenager. I like flaming hot Cheetos. You know that pretzel, the the, the flaming hot Cheetos. You want to bring in your fireman, put out put it out late in the game. You know that you kind of got a little spice there, and you're gonna. You're going to have it. Now pitching for the Rangers, the brisket croissant. The brisket croissant, I like it because, you know, I like the brisket and the bread and all that. The croissant was good. The brisket was good. The sauce was good. Nolan Ryan beef. The croissant was flaky. The sweet baby's glaze that they made it a little bit extra sweet. And the brisket worked. And there was almost like eating a kolache to me. So I really liked it. Let's make that closer, right? Don't we want something a little sweeter? All right, so that's got, that's got some sweetness. I can yeah, go with that. Yeah, a little sweeter. It's not a dessert, but... The croissant was sweet. It's sweet baby raised barbecue. Sauce. Right. We'll All right. I'll, that's fine. We can we can close out the game with that. The croissant makes it sweet, and that little sweet baby raised barbecue sauce. That's sweet too. Mm, that's the closer right there. So we've got our rotation. We figured out our ace and our closer, and I've established my palm through the Amazon palm scan, and I'm going to open this gate because I got to be honest with you. Our data is not completely scientific, so I'm going to go back for a second.